guys and welcome to this video. Today in Houston we have a snow day so the whole city is going like completely crazy. Everything's shut down and it's extremely cold outside. But I'm still gonna dangerously and bravely go to the gym today. So it's not snowing, there's ice forming everywhere. This is my first time ever driving in the ice or in the snow, whatever you want to call it. I should probably put my camera down. Just pulled up to Alphalete Gym and everyone's cars are literally turning into icicles. Honestly, it actually feels colder here in Houston, Texas than it did in New York. Today I have legs. My first leg session in over two, three weeks because of my tendonitis in my knees. If you guys watched my last video, I explained what happened to my knees and what I was going through, the recovery process. Uh, my chiropractor has now granted me permission to work out legs. So today I'm going to take it a little lighter than usual and see what I can put up. This is a product of 20 degree weather. squats up until four weeks ago and today 315 was a huge struggle but the most important thing is that I'm making progress and I'm slowly getting back slowly keyword slowly slowly getting back to where I used to be and it's a process man I gotta trust the process as I preach I have to actually practice it too so I'm gonna trust the process I'm gonna stop here at the squats for today and then move over to some accessory movements for the rest of the leg workout post-workout I have rice on my lens two servings of rice the whole container of Uncle Ben's uh, basmati rice, and then I have four ounces of grilled chicken, and then I have two scoops of Legion Whey cookies and cream protein. If you guys want to grow, you're gonna have to eat. If you want to, anything that has to do with muscul muscularity, muscular growth, or anything like that, you have to eat. You can't achieve anything without eating. I didn't really think this would happen, but it did happen. Check this out. Freaking snow. Houston, Texas. I know that may not be a lot to most of y'all because, or some of y'all, because y'all may live in like New York or the colder areas of the United States, but that's a lot to us. So everyone keeps asking for a video on how I get up on the counter. I'm gonna show y'all how right now. Make sure everything's out of your pocket and you just simply hop up. All right, outfit of the evening. I have the Chicago Ones EPTM track pants. I have this champion hoodie, and I have this proper shirt under, and my Lululemon backpack. Milo, come in here. Sit. Are you ready for a summer party? I don't think you're ready. So since we're gonna be inside the rest of the evening, I'm a huge wine guy. It happened recently, but I'm really into wine. There we go. Heidi, do you know what this means? Oh, menage a trois. You know the wine we were drinking yesterday? Threesome. <laughs> that means threesome, yeah. yeah. Wait, wait, really? who was drinking it? Well, me and Christian. <laughs> Someone DM me this morning and told me that, hey, just in case you, you didn't know, this means like threesome. Menage a trois. Yeah. I didn't really think about that. I was just like, man manage choice. <laughs> ah, this is amazing. <laughs> Blizzard. There's still frosticles. Wow, this this is really ice, man. <laughs> it's colder than Alaska. Fucking yeah. <laughs> Gym open up at 12 p.m. Right now, me and Christian have the luxury of working out in a 
somewhat empty gym. First movement of the day, we have seated rows with the mag grip. Going for three sets of 10 to 12. And on the last set, we're gonna do a quadruple or triple drop set to where we go to failure for each set. Four sets, keeping my chest pumped up, elbows on my side, minimal to no swinging, and just curling. for biceps on pull days. This is the final bicep movement of the day. We have preacher curls, we have 45 and 25, going for 10 to 12 reps. Pretty heavy set, we just did 20 reps, so if I'm gas, that's my excuse. So we just played a game of 2K, and Christian's not gonna show the score, <laughs> but I won by how many, 18 points? 17. 17 points. I was a Celtics, he was the Cavaliers. Cavaliers are actually my favorite team, so same with him. But I let him choose the Cavaliers, and now we're about to play another game. What's going on guys? So I just got back from Christian's house for some reason. During that game, my camera just stopped working. I don't know, but he won. One game out of three games, I've been in the last two games, so it doesn't really matter. Came home to this home-cooked meal. Well, I didn't come home to it. I actually came home and cooked this home-cooked meal. I have two burgers with 90-10 sirloin beef, pico de gallo, pepper jack cheese, same thing in this one. And then I have sweet potato fries and a Diet Coke. Gonna chill, relax, spend the night at my home tonight, answer some client emails, and uh, yeah, it's gonna be a really chill now. I'll probably hop on 2K later and Twitch. Twitch. It's now 9.14 a.m. 28 degrees outside. Go to the post office because I am trying to secure the bag. I actually tried to secure this bag yesterday, but the post office I went to was the wrong one. So today I'm going to the post office I was supposed to go to, and I'm really hoping that they have the bag that I'm looking for. So good news guys, the package was secured. I'm so happy. I was only expecting to get this big boy, but instead I got these, these two packages. I'm gonna open these, damn I'm super ashy. Gonna open, both, gonna open both of them up right now because I'm excited and I can't wait. And I really want to know what the hell this is. The Air Jordan 1 Gatorade Edition. <sighs> so beautiful. Been waiting for a while for these. I'm happy I finally got them. The second package that I promise I'll show y'all is from Creations by Vince. He's a painter out in California, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure he's from California. Here's his information right here. Good look at it. He sent me five paintings, all right here, that I'm gonna hang somewhere in my house. So shout out to Vince for the paintings. These are really, really dope. I really like this one the best, actually. So I can pick it up. Ooh. Yeah, I like this one the best, and I think it would go great somewhere around here. Me and Russ are actually gonna play another game of 2K tonight, and the loser, get this. The, oh shit, <laughs> almost dropped my camera. The loser has to jump. Okay, keep in mind it's 30 degrees here in Houston, Texas. We've had like a real freeze over the last couple of days. The loser has to jump into my apartment swimming pool in 30 degree weather, only wearing underwear. 
Alright, right, so my name is Charlotte Coker and I lost the 2K challenge. <laughs> my consequence is jumping into the pool at 30 degree weather. In 30 degree weather. It's very cold. Jumping! 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 Yo, hurry up, man. Jumping! Oh my god. <laughs> bro, my body is tingling, bro. No, bro. <laughs> It looks like there's sprinkles on me. <laughs> hey, look, look, look. <laughs> bro, I'm steaming? Yeah, man. There's steam coming out of your body. Alright, so just finished up my fourth therapy session here at a Rosti here in Sugarland. And I'm getting better, guys. I'm getting better. And um, their motto here at Arasti is we fix pain fast. And I'm really starting to believe it because I'm feeling less and less pain every single time. So shout out to my boy Jordan for hooking me up and making sure I'm able to squat again. Right now, I'm about to go do something really big, really big for me and really big for the YouTube channel. I'm about to make a huge upgrade. Well, not a huge upgrade. It's going to be a decent size upgrade. And it's going it's gonna to be an upgrade that you guys are going to be able to notice in my next video. We'll see what it is. Hello there. How's it going? You notice anything different? Yeah, you do. And if you say you don't, you're lying. All right, so I, I kind of did a thing. Sold this bad boy, which I'll be shipping tomorrow, and upgraded. Let me see if I can show you all the box since I'll, I can't show you all the actual camera because I'm actually vlogging with it. I got the Sony 6300 with, bear with me, I'm not really good with cameras. Still learning with the Sigma 16 millimeter f1.4 f DCDN 67 millimeter filter size contemporary lens. Yeah, that's what I got. And that's why my quality looks 10 times better than what it did before. So I've had the Canon 70D for about a year, year and a half, and it was great. It was an awesome camera, but I wanted to take up the quality just a notch, and I got the 6300 for a little bit more. But it's worth the investment, as you guys can see. You guys are going to be seeing quality like this for a very long time, and it's going to be awesome, and I'm only going to get better. Mala, come here. Show the camera how you look on YouTube, on this new camera. I'll show YouTube how you look. Sit on her and kind of just blurs out the background. That's because this, this lens is just badass. So that's going to be my quality from here on out for a while. Hope you guys like it. I know, it got, I know it looks better, and if you guys comment and say it doesn't, then I really don't care because I'm, this is my camera. Like, there's nothing I can do about it. I know I'm going to end this video. Thank you guys for watching this video. I love all of you guys so, 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 so much. I'll see you all next time.